everyone and welcome back to Shell's Glam Home. Well today I'm excited to share guys another two Rustic Glam Fall DIY projects. I hope you enjoy. I started with a piece of pine wood that I picked up from my local thrift store for just 50 cents. I wanted to create a full sign for a spot that I had next to my fireplace. I love rustic glam decor guys and I knew this would be the perfect shape and size for what I had in mind. After a light sanding I took it outside and gave it two coats of my favourite white spray paint by Jewel Arts. Now the thing I did here guys was even though I gave it two coats, I gave it very light coats so that the rustic side of things would shine through. Here I didn't even need to sand anything back, it gave that shabby look that I was aiming for. I then took these gold glitter letters that I picked up from Typo here in Australia, but you could take some letters and cover them in gold glitter to get the same effect. picked up four of these letters to spell out the word fall. I love how sparkly and gold they were and they had such a shimmer to them. I then placed them onto my wood to see that they would fit nice and neatly and then off camera I hot glued them in place. That were completely dry, I took these gold glitter stickers that I picked up from my local dollar store and I added them randomly all over my wood. I then took this gold glitter leaf that I already had from Christmas last year and I hot glued it underneath the F. Guys, I absolutely love how I created this sign from virtually nothing. That rustic piece of wood came up so beautifully without even having to distress it. And I got that rustic glam feel with lots of glitter and lots of beautiful polka dots. I love how it sits perfectly in the spot that I had for it next to my fireplace. Guys, this was one of those simple DIY projects that anyone could do. For example, I love how I just took a scrap piece of wood and I was able to create this sign for the fall season. But a handy tip here that I've seen on Instagram stories is that you can create this one for fall, but then turn it over and create something else. I'm planning on turning this one over at Christmas time and creating something along the lines of the words Noel. This is such a wonderful idea guys to create two signs for the price of one. Because I change out my decor so regularly, I want to save money in the way that I style and create things. And here is a typical example of getting two types of signs for two different seasons. And I'll share that with you again as we get closer to Christmas. My next DIY project started when I purchased a new set of sheets for my bed. I don't know if you've noticed guys, but they are creating a little bag now that pops the sheets inside. So when I removed the sheets, I took a look at this and said, hey, what could Shell make out of this? Taking some hobby fill, I filled that baby up as much as I possibly could. complete you're then going to take an elastic band guys and you're going to pull it all together as if you were tying a ponytail and tie it in a knot. Once that was complete you're going to take some burlap string and just tie around and around and around. 
I then cut it off once it was complete and I then tucked it underneath the top. I then took some more string and what you're going to do here guys is just overlap it across the front and then tie underneath. You're then going to repeat the same steps guys and just go over three to four times until your little bag is starting to look like a pumpkin. Once that was complete, I then took this dollar store polka dot ribbon. Can you tell that your girl Shell loves her polka dots? And I simply tied a piece around the top of the stem. I then took this gorgeous brooch from bedazzle.com and I tied it to the front of the stem. I then also took another one of those Christmas glitter leaves and I hot glued it to the side of the stem. And here is my adorable Rustic Glam Pumpkin. Who would have thought guys that you could create something so simple that came from a new set of sheets? So next time you're out buying that doona cover or your new set of sheets, keep in mind that that little bag that it comes in could definitely create lots of pumpkins for you. The thing I loved most about this little DIY was everything was pretty much done for you. The elastic was there guys, the bag was there, all you needed to do was bring it all together. I love glam decorating, but I also love anything that is rustic and shabby. And here I bought these two styles together with such a simple and inexpensive DIY project to give me the rustic glam look I was aiming for. So guys, I know I can hear you all now. Where is that little bag that my sheets came in? Here is a simple and inexpensive DIY, guys, that I know every single person out there can do. If you're going to have a go at this very simple DIY, I'd truly love to see photos, guys. Just tag me on Instagram, at Shell's Glam Home, and it would make my heart so, so happy to see all these little bags from our sheet sets turn into pumpkins. So which of these DIY projects are you going to have a go at this weekend? Guys, I know that decorating can be expensive, but I love sharing ideas with you that you can create things and still have that fall decorative piece you're aiming for without having to break the bank. So much for watching guys i truly hope you've enjoyed this video i hope i've inspired you to have a go at your very own glam fall rustic decor These little projects, don't forget guys, can be taken on in any possible way. You could have your own personal style and add it to these types of DIYs. Just pick the style you're after, use the same methods that I have shown you, and you could create your very own DIY fall projects this weekend. to like, share and subscribe to my channel because I'll be back real soon with more DIY projects, inspirational ideas and room tours here at Shell's Glam Home. So 
until next time, my friends, I thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.